project of salvation and explaining our relationship with this um, present world and how our life here is related to the eternal life. That's the problem of Islam, if, if you want to call it a problem. And the problem of all Abrahamic religion, which is basically Islam and uh, Christianity. Christianity and Judaism are its uh, distorted forms. There's no, there's no doubt about that. And second is the Hegelian problem of the relationship between mind and matter, whether uh, uh, at, at the human level or at the cosmic level. And third is the scientific problem, the problem of um, modern science, which is to know the world in order to master it so we can subjugate this world to human will. And obviously last uh, um, point, two points have nothing to do with the first point. And it is reading this first point in terms of second and third point, which is what makes uh, Allah Iqbal's efforts here part and parcel of Muslim modernism. This is basically reading and redefining Islam and Christianity in terms of modernity, in terms of Hegelian philosophy and in terms of uh, modern science and its search uh, to master the universe and subjugate it to human will. Um, on the other hand, um, you know, Hegelian philosophy and like Hegelian philosophy is basically um, the rejection of the creation, um, the fact that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has created um, both matter and mind. And their interconnection is defined by the fact that they are both creation of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the world and this cosmos is finite. It is not infinite. And the project of um, modern science to master the universe and subjugate it is an Iblisi project uh, because it is Iblis who uh, tried to persuade Adam alayhi salam to build a, uh, a kingdom in this world which will never end and to seek eternity through mastering, um, through eating the fruit of uh, the forbidden fruit, the fruit of the transgression of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Anyway, so let's go back. So, yeah, yeah, recognizing the contact of the idol with the real and say yes to the world of matter. <laughs> yes to the world of matter, materialism. And points the way to master it and subjugate it to human will so it can regulate the life, become the master of this life and this universe, which is the Hegelian project as well as the project of modern science, not the project of Islam and Christianity. Okay, that's a good point to solve. We'll continue, inshallah.